take a look at solving a perimeter word problem right here. And we're going to try and use the problem solving method that we've talked about in class. Read the problem, establish the variables, write an equation, solve the equation, answer the question. Okay, so let's see what we can do here with uh, reading. The height of a rectangle is 12 more than twice its base. If the perimeter of the rectangle is 234 inches, what is the height of the rectangle? Forgive my grammar here. This should be a comma. That should be a lowercase w. Use the organizer below and show all of your work for full credit. The perimeter formula is perimeter equals 2 times base plus 2 times height. Okay, let's read again and try and actively read it. It says the height of the rectangle is. Well, that should be a hint that we're telling you the height. So that means the base will probably be the thing we don't know. 12 more than twice its base. Well, there you go with base. I don't know what the base is. So if the perimeter of the rectangle is 234 inches, what's the height of the rectangle? Well, it seems to me that the height is the question. So I could probably put a star there. And I could probably say h equals here. I could probably even say inches already, even though I don't know the number that goes there, but it's good to get now. So, use the organizer below for full credit. Okay, well, first we need to, in that first sentence, realize it says the height of the rectangle is 12 more than twice its base. It means I do not know the base, the base is x. And the height is. 12 more and twice the base. So you do 2 times the base for twice and then 12 more. It's good to label the figure. The base is the bottom end. The height is which runs vertically. And you can also label all four sides given the property of a rectangle having two sets of congruent sides. Okay, so now we're going to write an equation. And our equation is based on this. The perimeter, which we know, is 234. Equals 2 times the base. Well, I do know the base. It's x. So I'll write x. Sorry. A little off with the uh, writing there. Then plus... 2 times the height. Well, I know the height. The height is 2x plus 12. So, 2x plus 12. I want you guys to appreciate here that this is just plugged in. Perimeter, perimeter. Equals, equals. 2, 2. Base, I call it x. Plus, plus. 2, 2. Height, was this relationship from the table. Now solve the equation. It's just what we always have done. D, C, G, undo, plus, minus, undo, times, divide. So is there anything to distribute here? There sure is. So we're going to go 234 equals 2x plus 4x plus, excuse me, I made a little misprint here. This was supposed to be a 12. So the distribution is going to be 2 times 12 is 24. Sorry for that mistake. I just miscopied it from here. So you know, we've got 234 equals 6x plus 24. By collecting like terms, I've gotten that. And we're going to subtract 24 from both sides. We're going to get 210 equals 6x. Now we're going to divide by 6. This is a skill we've seen many times. 6 goes into 21, 3, with 3 left over. 6 goes into 30, 5 times. So if x is 35, it means I can put that 35 right there. Do 2 times 35 plus 12 which is getting me 70 plus 12, 
which is getting me 82, making the height 82 inches. So that is it. You can check it on your calculator by doing 2 times x, which was 35, plus 2 times 82. Okay, and then you would see that that does in fact come out to 234 on your calculator.